Hi everyone. Hello, hello, hello. Just getting ready. Can you hear me? And can you hear the piano? Don't worry if you haven't had the email yet. Uh, everyone's saying, I haven't had the email. Ready to sing. Lots of no email. Yes. Yes, you can hear me. Yes, yes, yes. Great. Fab. Um, we've got about five minutes. So just hang on. Have a cup of, make yourself a cup of tea. We're going to start at half past um, once Boris is out of the way. I'll make it 10 minutes. 10 minutes. No Boris tonight. Oh, well, there we are. What a shame. Good. Okay. I think we are getting pretty close. Plug my phone in. Oh, you don't get this action with Joe Wicks, do you? Would you like, what would you like us to sing? Let us know in the comments. Yes, that would be really great. Good, that's all fine.
Don't worry if you've got the if you haven't got the email. I'm seeing quite a few people. Five minutes, four minutes. I'm kind of ready, but let's let's start when we say we're going to start. Oh, Instagram. Good point. I haven't put the link on Instagram. Let me do that now. That is a good point. Copy this link. Oh man, so much technology. Right. Let's make this happen. No, how do I do this? Create. There we go. Paste. First. Whoops, not frost. First rehearsal. Here. Yeah. Hope that's right. No, absolutely did not work. I'm going to go live on Insta. Hello, everyone on Instagram. Um, head over to uh, you, um, Decca Records on YouTube or go to my Facebook if you want to go live with me in about two minutes. Good. I'll make it three minutes now. Oh, this is fun. I love that people are saying this is fun. We haven't even started. Brilliant. Hi from Leicester. Lots of comments. We've got 2.8K people watching. That's brilliant. And we haven't even started. Three minutes to go. Okay, that's all good. Right, here we are. One minute thirty, people. One minute thirty. Whoop whoop. Three point two k. Hello, everyone. Download is broken. Brilliant. Well, <laughs> welcome to my week. Welcome to my week. The link for the material doesn't work. Okay, message is going really fast now. Um. Okay, don't worry about the download. It's fine. We're just going to do something. We're going to have some fun today. Um, and we will make sense of it as time goes on. Um, I'm running my sleeves up because that's what politicians do when they mean business. And as you know, I mean business. Okay. Lots of us who can't download the music. Don't worry, we'll get the music to you. Can I give a shout out to Hitchin Brook Community Choir? Hello. I'm going to do loads of shout outs. I'm going to do lots of things. Let's take my wallet out of my pocket because, quite frankly, I'm not going to be needing it for a very long time. Um, right. 25 seconds. <clears throat> Should be happening. Oh. Somebody had a heart transplant. Gosh, they locked up for weeks. Well, aren't we all? But that sounds much more, much more serious. I hope you're well. Gosh, so many messages. How fantastic. Okay, we've got nearly 5,000 people. That's amazing. That's amazing. I mean, given that this is the first thing like this that I've ever done. Um, hey, it's half past. Boom. Welcome. Hello. Welcome to my back garden. I had this uh, amazing studio built in my back garden which seemed like a crazy idea when I did it. And now it seems like the best thing I ever could have done because I now have somewhere the, where we can share music. I don't know about you, but the last few days have been very difficult, very depressing at times, quite sad. Um, and we're all having to adjust to a very different way of life. And technology is at the heart 
of making all sorts of things possible. And it's just, it's brilliant to see nearly 6,000 people share, sharing in this moment. And I know so many people, I've had just message after message after message of people saying my community choir has been taken away from me and and choir is not just about singing it's about people it's about connections it's about life and that's what we're all missing and I'm missing it too I'm supposed to have a a concert on Thursday night with all my kids in my kids choir and they're all they're all hoping to come online and do it so I'm in the same boat as you are my wife has a a cough she's had a, a fever um, and, and a headache, and so we're, we're, I'm, I'm there. I'm there. I'm there with you. But I think the only thing we can do is pick ourselves up and try and make something of it. So I'm very inspired by the brilliant Joe Wicks. I watched Joe this morning, and I did all his stretches. Um, I was really, really terrible, but um, I, I, I thought it was a great session. T- today, this is a bit of a test. It's the first time that I've ever done anything like this. It's the first time I'm testing the internet in my house. I've absolutely no idea how this is going to go. I can see 273 likes. So this is good news. I can see lots of people going, yay. So that's great. Um, Don't worry about the material. We have got weeks of this. We're in it for the long haul. We are here to serve you and to keep our own minds going. So for now, why don't we just do a little bit of a warm up, a Gareth Malone warm up and see how that feels. And then we'll talk about what we're going to do and why we're on YouTube and how it's going to work and all the other technologies and all those big questions that you're probably asking, how's this going to work and what's it going to be? I'll try to answer them. So I would like you in your houses to stand up like me. Really important to stand up when we're singing. Let's stand up. Let's get out of our seats and let's get the body going. So give your hands a good shake. I will start with a shake. Shake them up high. I can't see you, but I'm imagining it. And you look great. And shake them down low. Shake them over there. Shake them over there. That's it. Good. And let's do shoulders in circles. Round in circles. Very good. And the other way. Round in circles. There we go. Ooh. And if you fancy it, a little creak. Let's get the voice going. Head to one side. Roll it around the front. Oh, that feels nice. Roll it around the back. Roll it just side to side. And feel that nice stretch down here. There we are. Lots of people saying hello from all over the country, if not all over the world, which is amazing. Um, I'm glad that you like my glasses. Big face, small face, wide face, long face, big face, small face, wide face, long face, big face, small face, wide face, long face. Give it a good shake. Right, we're really going to try and loosen up this whole apparatus because when we're singing, we don't want any tension. And it's a very tense time. We want to be nice and relaxed. So what you're going to do for me is just, uh, you're going to dig the road. We're going to go, and you're in your own homes. And normally when I do it this at choir, I have to see everyone and everyone has to see each other. But you're in your own home. So give it a good shake. Excellent. I know that someone's going to cut that just that bit and repeat it forever and put it on YouTube. Because that's the sort of thing that happens on the internet. Um, let's do some tongue exercises. We're going to warm up the tongue by making circles on one side. Mm-hmm. And circles on the other side. Mm-hmm. Let's go back. Mm-hmm. And one there. Mm-hmm. If you're just joining us, don't worry about the material for now. Don't worry about the email. Let's just stand up. Let's get involved and start making some great noises. Um, I'd love to just do a little stretch and then a bit of a, oh, let all that tension out and then slowly build back up, ruining your hair and stretch up, touch the ceiling and flop. Ugh. Great. Let's do that a couple more times. Feels really good. Stretches out the legs. That's it. Oh, good stretch. Sorry, that's my tummy. And stretch. Oh, flop. And last one, nice and slowly back up. Excellent. Okay, next thing we're going to do is think about our breath. Um, a breath comes from this whole section of your body. It's not just from up here or just in here. It needs to go very deep when we're singing. So I'd like you to feel your hips just here and just above the hips in what I like to call the squidgy bit. If you dig your fingers in quite hard and go, <clears throat> you'll feel a little pulse. You'll feel your muscles just moving. Can you all feel that? Try that. <clears throat> if you can't feel anything, it's probably not that you are there's something wrong. It's probably just that you're not digging in hard enough or coughing loudly enough. 
we just try that one more time. <clears throat> That's good. Now let's give it a little. <sighs> and you can probably see my tummy. <sighs> it's just moving out. <sighs> good. Have we all got that? Let's do some. We're going to go. And feel those muscles really working to get all the air out and relax. And try it again. Relax. Good. Uh, forgive me looking over here. I'm just looking at all the comments. And we've got C Canada, like Switzerland, 10,000 people, Jersey. Amazing. And even the guinea pig is joining in. That's brilliant. So that's our breath. We're going to do a little bit of panting. We're going to go. So I'll do it, you copy me. I think that's quite enough of that. Well done. Thank you. We're going to do a couple of little songs and things at the piano now. But before we do that, we need to actually get the voice making some pitches. So the way that I like to do that is by just humming first. So it's not as if we're singing. We're just making a little noise. We're going, mmm, that's nice. Mmm. So just feel, mmm, feel the vibrations there. Mmm. Just try and get a nice resonant, mmm, nice resonant feel. If you feel the top of your head, mmm. might even feel mm, someone's getting strange looks from the dogs mm. even here um, especially if you're a bass or an alto you might get a little bit more rumbling i can feel it in my ribcage there mm. good next thing we're going to do is just do a little bit of sirening so taking that on one step this is where you make the sound uh, at the end of the word sing mm. and you you sort of stretch your vocal cords mm. Like that, as if they were a rubber band, but very easily. There's no effort involved. Simple, simple, simple. Let's make sure your posture's good. Mine wasn't. Just play around with that, making noises. Um, get your children involved. See who can go highest, so you can go deepest. Shouldn't be loud. I'm a bit worried about the people who are typing. I hope you're making the noises as well and doing the actions. Um, you should have seen me sweating with uh, Joe Wick earlier. Uh, right, enough of that. We are going to do... I'm going to do one of my favourite warm-ups of all time. I did not invent any of these warm-ups, but they're just out there in the public domain. I just love to do this one. And it always puts a smile on my face and on the faces of choirs. Mm. So it's, oh, the... It's my version of, oh, the grand old Duke of York. And it goes like this. Oh, the grand old Duke of York. He had 10,000 men. He marched them up to the top of the hill and he marched them down again. I think most of you probably know it. Oh, the grand old Duke of York, he had 10,000 men. He marched them up to the top of the hill and he marched them down again. And when they were up, they were up. And when they were down, they were down. And when they were only halfway up, they were neither up nor down. Now, we're going to go on, but this time you can't say up. Which makes it slightly more complicated. Oh, the grand old Duke of York, he had 10,000 men. He marched them to the top of the hill and he marched them down again. And when they were, they were, and when they were down, they were down. And when they were only halfway up, oh no, neither, nor down. It's not as easy as it sounds. Okay, this time you can say up, but you can't say down. Oh, the grand old Duke of York, he had 10,000 men. He marched them up to the top of the hill and he marched them again and when they were up they were up and when they were they were and when they were only halfway up they were neither up nor okay this time you can't say either but we're gonna go faster oh the grand old duke of york he had ten thousand men he marched them to the top of the hill and he marched them again and when they were they were and when they were they were and when they were only halfway they were neither nor 
Okay, this time we're gonna swap them round and we're going really fast. Swap them round, so up is down and down is up. Oh, the grand old Duke of York, he had 10,000 men. He marched them down to the top of the hill and he marched them again. And when they were down, they were down. And when they were up, they were up, I'm lost. And when they were only halfway up, they were neither down nor up. Now this time, you can only sing up or down and nothing else. One, two, three. Up, down, up, up, down, down, up, uh, up, down. <sighs> Very well done. Give yourselves a round of applause. Do a high five. Woo! Shake your hands in the air. Excellent. Very good. Uh, next little warm up we're going to do is going to be another little tongue twister. So these are very familiar to lots of you in choirs. That hurts your brain. Brilliant. Well, that's good. At least you're not thinking about anything else. Um, I, I know lots of people do that warm up. So really, really, um, that was so hard. Good. Well, we'll do it again in a few days, maybe see if anyone's improved. Um, I call it another, another little one that is real, a real little uh, mind bender for you. Um, and it's this. It's... Um, it's danger men at work, danger men at work, danger men at work, danger men at work, danger men. Now, we may not get this right this week, but I think if we're here for three weeks, four weeks, five weeks, six weeks, who knows how long this is going to go on? Maybe you'll get it. Uh, so it goes like this. Um, danger men at work, danger men at work, danger men at work, danger men at work, danger men. And the syllables keep going round. At work, danger men. At work, danger men. At work, danger men. At work, danger men. At work, Dane. German at work, Dane. German at work, Dane. German at work, danger men. 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 At work, danger. Men at work danger, men at work danger, men at work danger, men at work. Yes. Did you get it? Oh my God, I can't keep up. We'll do it one more time. Here we go. So we'll start slowly. I find it really helps with this one. If you go, if you think of this as danger, men at work, danger, men at work, gets the brain going. Here we go. Here we go. Danger men at work, 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 danger men at Work danger, men at work, danger, danger, men at work. I think I was right. I'm going to give myself a round of applause because I was trying to play the piano and think about something else at the same time. And that's very, very difficult. Great thing about singing, I think, is that you just cannot help but put your heart and soul into it and forget about your woes or whatever else is going on in the world and, and, and have a good time. Um, some of you utterly confused. That's excellent. Um, we're going to do just some humming now. So like a light thing. Just moving up gently. Let's open onto an oo. Good. Um, nice way to just uh, get the voice a little bit more, a little bit more stylish. OK, so with uh, 15 minutes in, I'd like to talk to you a little bit about what we're going to do and how this is going to work. Now, many, many, many people have been contacting me about using Zoom, about doing uh, trying to do choir together on the Internet. Now, many have tried and many have have had varying degrees of success. Now, I know that some of the technology for your local choirs 
It's fantastic. You can just about get together, do a small rehearsal up to about 100 people on Zoom. That really works. We've got 13,000. That's amazing. 13,000 people uh, joined in here. So obviously, we can't put them all on the screen at the same time. So at the moment, for now, in the next few days, I'm going to be here every single day at five o'clock. Sorry, 5.30, just after Boris, to lift our spirits whenever he's doing a um, doing a little message about this current situation. Um, I will be here at 5.30 and we'll we'll do a little warm up and we'll introduce material. Now, you should have got a download, but welcome to the joys of modern technology. The download link doesn't seem to have worked. But I said, don't worry. That's right. Somebody's saying, don't worry. Don't worry about the materials. So I've got this. But I'm going to just talk you through it. It's very, very simple. A bit of a test today. I mean, literally, I've been plugging wires in and cameras and all of that all day, all weekend to, tr to try and make this work. So it's a little bit of a test. So if you've enjoyed it, please come back tomorrow and we'll, we'll do a bit more. The song that I would like to start with, we will work on every single day. We'll start with a melody line. And then for people who want to, you can stay on afterwards and I will go through the alto line, the tenor line, and the bass line, which are some simple oohs and ahs and some you know little harmony harmony lines, which many of you will be used to in your choirs. Um, so it's really optional. You the the melody is very simple. Children can sing it. Abs it's a very well known song, and we're going to use that as our sort of test. We're going to see whether this works, how it works, and you can let me know and the team at Decca know. Uh, what what you've enjoyed about it and what you haven't enjoyed and how we can make it better. So this is, as I said, this is my first ever internet broadcast. So I'm trying, I'm trying. So bear with me. The song that I would like to do is You Are My Sunshine, which I think is just the most beautiful song. It has fantastic sentiment. It's a really good sentiment for the moment because we all need sunshine. Um, but it's also about not being able to be with someone that you love because they're away from you. Um, and now the reasons for that, you can you can decide for yourself. But I, I think it's very poignant at the moment. I've got a really lovely arrangement that has been done uh, especially for this. Uh, this is a world premiere of it. I'm going to see if I can play the track and hopefully you'll be able to hear it. Um, good. Yeah. Oh, lots of people liking the song. That's good. Um, if you don't know it, I'm just going to sing a little bit of this. Um, so this is the track. Uh, I can get the computer to work. Slightly more complicated doing music in this way. Hopefully you can hear that. You are my sunshine, my only sunshine. You make me happy when skies are grey. You'll never know, dear, how much I love you. Please don't take my sunshine away. You are my sunshine, my only sunshine. You make me happy when skies are grey. You'll never know, dear, how much I love you. Please don't take my sunshine away. The other night, dear, as I lay sleeping, I dreamed I held you in my arms. But when I woke, dear, I was mistaken. So I hung my head and cried. You are my sunshine, my only sunshine. You make me happy when skies are grey. You'll never know, dear, how much I love you. Please don't take my sunshine away. In all my dreams, dear, you seem to leave me. When I awake, my poor heart pains. So when you come back and make me happy, I'll forgive you, dear, I'll take all the blame. 
You are my sunshine, my only sunshine. You make me happy when skies are gray. You'll never know, dear, how much I love you. Please don't take my sunshine away. Then we repeat the chorus. You're my sunshine. Really loudly, my only sunshine. I'm really going for it. Never know, dear, how much I love you. Please don't take my sunshine away. Little piano out, out lewd, post lewd, outro. There we go. Um, so I just stop that. Uh, I just want to say a big shout out to all of the team at Hal Leonard and uh, MusicRoom.com uh, and Jonna in particular for arranging that. Thank you so much. Did it yesterday afternoon. Um, I'm just so pleased with it. I think it's going to be beautiful. So look, it's a it's a moving song. I think the arrangement's really mo moving. It, it could be incredible. My plan is this: that by the end of the this week, if not, like maybe the end of the weekend, we have a video to show the world that 14,000 people got involved, got online and made something out of this out of this misery and grimness, that there is human spirit and something beautiful uh, in sharing your voices. I am really sorry that we can't just I can't I can't wave a magic wand and make the Internet clever enough that we can all be in the, the same room at the same time. Unfortunately, there is a technical limitation here of the internet, which is that the time it takes for my piano to get to your room and for your sound to get back to me is so long that by the time I've started, you're only just picking up your music and we're completely out of time. So the way that we're gonna do this, and I'm gonna talk you through this in very, very baby steps, don't worry, I'll make it so obvious. I'll do online videos, I'm going to do little tutorials, get my friends involved. I've got loads of people, really fun people lined up to run warm-ups and, and help out with this. Um, we will be doing, uh, we will be getting you to record part by part, sending it in to me. And uh, me and the team, uh, Max is going to chop them all up and put them all together and, and build it that way. Uh, very much inspired by um, Eric Whittaker, who created, uh, I think, the, one of the first online choruses a few years ago, but on an even, maybe an even bigger scale. We've got 15,000 people. I hope you're all going to get involved in that. Um, the, all you really need is to get the email, and you don't need it tonight. It's fine. I just wanted to introduce the idea. Um, you'll then need to download. There's a PDF, a little sheet of paper, you can print off or you can look at it on your phone, doesn't matter. Um, and you will then need something to record your voice if you want to send it in. So that could be a phone. I'd love it with video. So the way that I would do it would be to get my phone. If you've got some headphones, that would be amazing. Plug it in and we'll record it and you'll record to the backing track. And I will go through all of the details of how to how you can do that. Um, over the, over the coming days, um, let's just see. Have we got any questions before we go? Because I really I really enjoyed this. It was really fun. It seems like it's worked. Uh, thanks for this, Gareth. I'm really missing my usual choir. I know we all are. We're missing human contact. I've only seen my family, and I love my family. But it's good to see other people. This is absolutely fantastic. Now, do I want instruments? Is a brilliant question. We're definitely going to have instruments. I would like this to be a kind of virtual orchestra. Um, I've got grand plans. You know me. Stick with me. We will do something incredible. We're going to make this into an opportunity. And I think this could be really wonderful and inspiring. And I'd love it to be the thing that people re will remember about the isolation is that we made something. The, the, the comments are going so fast that I can't even read them. But let me have a quick look. Um, do I want your ukulele? I do. I want your ukulele. I do. Grand plans. Yeah, I've got grand plans. Uh, how do you get the email? We're going to resend it. Don't worry. Listen, so much tech, so many people involved, Decca Records, the publishers, um, uh, the, lots and lots of people. BBC have been incredibly supportive. Um, you're going to get an email about that. I've got, I'm talking to BBC, maybe about there being a little bit of a television 
section to this. I don't know. I would love some moment at the end of this 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 difficult difficult time uh, where we can come together and and be really proud of what we've done. So I'm going to leave it there for today because I think that's about 25 minutes. Which I think it's it is about right for an online session, and I know that somebody else is doing yoga at six. Um, honestly, you could be you could be busier now than ever. Please keep your your children involved. I'm really keen to have kids. I'm really keen to have um, solos. I will go through tomorrow when you've when we've definitely got the email out. I'm going to stay online afterwards, and I'm going to go through all of the parts here. It's really simple. It's It's that kind of thing. It's definitely manageable, even if you can't sing. And we're going to use every piece of technology available to make this sound absolutely fantastic. If it's, it feels like we've all, I've been complaining about technology, about the sort of distance that Instagram and Facebook and YouTube and Twitter puts between us at times. But my goodness, hasn't it come into its own? I just feel so lucky that I can sit here in my own back garden and I can broadcast to you via YouTube and um, I, I just feel like we live in an incredible time. We didn't have this available to us during the you know, Spanish flu after the First World War. You know, people away. My goodness, it, it must have been so frightening. And, and and not that it isn't frightening now, but at least we have this connection that we can make with people. Um, so, yeah, we will do soprano, alto, tenor, bass, proper choir. Going to make a great sound. Steve Lipson is on board and he's a fantastic producer. And he is a man who also has grand plans and great connections. We're going to do something really, really special. Um, sending you all lots of love genuinely love to you all love to the great british public and and everyone abroad because quite frankly if this has brought brought it home just how how we are one species on one planet and we we have to stick together and we have to work together and this really has brought it home so be safe Stay indoors, stay isolated, stay away from other people and, and, and do your bit. Um, I know I am. And I will see you here tomorrow at the same time, half past five for more. And there'll be always lots of excitement to come. I'm so excited. Thank you very much. Goodbye. <laughs>